بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه ومن تبعهم بإحسان إلى يوم الدين ما بعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته رمضان is almost coming to an end it's at its last week now ولله الحمد ومنا and I pray and I ask Allah سبحانه وتعالى to accept all your fasts your ibadah your Quranic recitation and your tarawih prayers. Ameen. Now, one might ask, Haji, is it really the good, uh, a good time to be recording this video in the month of Ramadan? This ain't going to be a long video, but what I want to show you is, in preparation to other videos that I've got to record, the level of ridiculousness, like to the point that when one watches this video, I don't understand what they're doing or what's the, the, the objective in, in this ritual and that's what I find these heretical um, Sufis especially you know the ones that we are seeing manifested today and I've got a video to record to show you that uh, one scholar what he mentions and he's a Sufi himself uh, or upon Tasawwuf uh, and again Tasawwuf has many spectrums and branches that you know <laughs> you know from the word in dervish is to putting knives in their you know tongues and and long hairs and whatnot but let's just watch this video and then we'll comment on it Seeing the giant anaconda uh, prayer beads, uh, tasbih, from these Nashabandi Sufis, and it's really, really confusing. Like it's so big, and they are kissing it. The, the 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 okay, you could say tabarruk or whatnot. So like I said, I ain't gonna no issue with tabarruk within limits, right? But. You see, um, look at my hand. What I'll do is just I'll just show you if no one caught it, it's right at the end. He's just sitting there, you know. I don't want to say anything because it's Ramadan. Astaghfirullah, uh, I'll leave it. Just watch it again. For those who weren't paying attention, you saw him, right? Now, I like to ask my Sufi brothers, right? Uh, Avoid toothpaste if you can. Now, what I like to ask my Sufi brothers, and, I, and I'm generally, generally asking this question, right? This individual who's been called out in Luton and a lot of the videos that I've recorded highlight the clear heresy, the Zandaqa that he's promoting. Now, I find a lot of his hardline followers, you know, send me messages and say well Haji you know you're a Wahhabi and, and, and look it just really highlights the level of sheep like following he has because to call him out I've been rendered as a Wahhabi anyone that knows anything about me knows I'm far from Wahhabi yes as an Athari uh, we might have certain Agreements in creed certain aspects. I'm not talking about it in totality, but certain aspects in when it comes to Allah's names and attributes Apart from those who go above um, And beyond uh, what Allah and his messenger has mentioned. Don't you have jealousy for the religion? Look Why can't we stay within the confines of the Quran and the Sunnah and, and upon the understanding of the Salaf? What, what's this, you know, and fabricated stories like the Sheikh Abdul Qadir and others like Junaid al-Baghdadi and Uais al-Qarni and, and you name it, like so many fairy tales, so many fabrications and this is a common pattern that we are finding. Now I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to guide us and them but I, I hate to say it and I, I'm going to have to be blunt again. A Salafi, who's what you call a card-carrying member Salafi, is much better than these as another cop. People might take that strongly, but I, I do seriously believe that a Salafi is far better. And it's, that's, that's not even like up for discussion as far as I'm concerned. So yeah, 
giant anaconda prayer beads like and there's other things as well you'll see like it's just baffling how these videos have been out and you know the videos that I've commented on over five six years ago seven years ago and then it's only now been picked up after I've mysteriously uploaded them onto my channel and, and shown the clear heresies so yeah just a quick video from me uh, you know I just got my you know somebody jacket on even though it's raining outside so take care of yourselves